What's up, everybody? It's VR Gamer Dude here, and today on Lunchtime with my Gear VR, we are going to take a ride through Welcome to Virtual Reality. And I want to thank Trey from Trey Tech for running a little contest over on Reddit where they gave away 10 keys. I was one of the lucky 10 to win a key for this one. Not that I wouldn't have bought it anyway, because uh, it is really that good. So if you have newcomers to VR and you want to just sit them down and run them through a awesome demo that shows them all of the potential for VR, then I highly, highly recommend grabbing a copy of Welcome to Virtual Reality. So... All right, I promise I'm not going to babble through this one. I'm going to let you guys experience it without me talking over it. So without further ado, let's go. Something about the possibility of visiting other worlds has always enticed us. Through whatever medium was available at the time, we have always felt a need to create worlds of our own. As technology improved, our creative ability grew more and more powerful. No longer were our creations restricted by pen and paper, but instead captivated us by the means of screens and speakers. The invention of the computer was perhaps our biggest advancement yet. It introduced the crucial element of interactivity, as well as the ability to share in our experiences with others. But now we find ourselves beginning the next chapter of our story, in which our worlds will come to life like never before. So sit back and relax as we take a journey into the world of virtual reality. Surrounded 360 degrees by your environment, you'll find yourself completely transported into another world. A world that feels truly alive. You can gauge the distance to the walls and ceiling. And as you move through the room, it feels almost like you could reach out and touch it. This sense of immersion will bridge the gap between you and your favorite games. You may even find yourself connecting with the characters and dangers in a whole new way. Another interesting aspect about virtual reality is the sense of scale. This room sitting on the table may look quite small, but who's to say that it isn't just a normal sized room? Who says that you are normal sized? When scale isn't a factor, adventures can be found in the most unexpected places, whether those be the size of a toy or the size of the galaxy. Unit 31, we are investigating a strange scanner reading and need additional support. Please exit the hangar and regroup with my squadron. Engines activated. Launching now. 
Everyone form up. This reading is very strange. Let me try boosting the signal. It's two titans, warping in from deep space. Perform evasive maneuvers. In three, two, one, go. We have to get out of range of these ships. They'll eat us alive. Increase power to the thrusters and try to warp out of here. Keep steady, 31. I'm rolling underneath one of these things. They've got theta class weaponry. They're eating through my shields. I've lost power. 31, watch your head. I'm coming in hot. 31, you're almost in an escape vector. Activate your warp drive now. Of course, sometimes you might not feel up to exploring a whole new world. If you'd rather sit on the couch and relax, virtual reality has you covered there as well. Whether you enjoy a large screen cinema, a comfortable home theater, or even just your favorite sofa, you'll always have the best seat in the house. But don't think for a second that virtual reality has to be a lonely place. Whether they be friends, family, or even strangers, you can share your worlds with others, no matter where they are. Hey, you. What's up? It's me, Francis. Oh, what are you doing? Whoa, are you watching a movie? Well, that's pretty cool, but I'm going to take it one step deeper. Virtual reality inside virtual reality. It has to be at least twice as good. Francis, I think this is a bad idea. Oh, it'll be just fine. Oh, wow. Now I'm underwater. Oh, my God. That whale's going to eat me. Uh, I'm gonna go one level deeper! Oh, what the heck is this? It's having me work a job? A job? Are you kidding me? I don't know that crap in real life! Why the heck would I want to do it VR? I'm gonna go one level deeper! Whoa, okay, now... I'm in a room watching a movie. This is so cool. Hey, wait a minute. Hey, this is where I started from. I don't even know what to believe anymore. kick-ass ride that was so trey absolutely man you have nailed it uh this this is so good to show newcomers and well i mean it's so good for anybody i mean just go to the oculus store grab this app i think it's like two bucks you know it's the best two bucks you'll ever spend for showing a newcomer virtual reality for their first time so 
Anyway, that's going to do it for me today. I got some tacos calling my name. It's lunchtime and I'm hungry. So, for everybody who watched the end of the video, I always want to thank you for doing that. And if you are a subscriber on the channel already, man, I can't thank you guys enough. You are helping me kill it. Uh, we have passed 2,500 subscribers and uh, it's no stopping it now. And uh, if this was your first time coming in to watch today, much appreciated. I, man, thank you so much for coming in to check out what I do here on Lunchtime with my Gear VR and on my channel. If you want to see more great VR content, head over to my main page and peruse through my videos, check out my sidebar, and uh, find links to the rest of the guys in the VR Spies. Uh, all of us are out here every day working hard to bring you guys the best in virtual reality content on YouTube. And I know we all appreciate your support immensely. And after you do all that, if you liked what you saw, don't forget to hit subscribe, man. I'd love to take you along the next time I take a ride through the wonderful, well, uh, wonderful world of virtual reality. Uh, that's a tongue twister right there. But uh, for me, that's going to do it. This is VR Gamer Dude, signing off, y'all. Peace.